The woman who wrongly accused a black teen of stealing her phone at a New York City hotel. She's now reportedly speaking out for the first time. As investigators say, they're considering charging her in the case. Adrian Bankert has the latest for us. Adrian, good morning. Good morning to you too, Whit. Yes, this still unnamed woman reportedly has concerns about how she's being portrayed in the now viral video. And she also says there's more to the story. This is my phone. Show me, no, you don't have to no, explain no, nothing to her. This morning, Manhattan's district attorney says he is actively investigating this on-camera altercation viewed nearly three million times on Instagram, showing a woman accusing jazz musician Keon Harold's son of stealing her phone. Are you kidding me? You feel like there's only one iPhone made in the world? In this newly released surveillance video, you can see the woman wrestle with Keon Jr. in the lobby, tackling him to the ground. The NYPD asking for help in locating the woman. On Wednesday, police say following a review of the video at the Arlo Hotel in downtown Manhattan, they're considering additional possible charges for the unnamed woman, including assault, grand larceny, and attempted robbery. The announcement comes after a meeting between prosecutors and Harold's family. We met with the district attorney and he uh, informed us that they had seen the hotel surveillance video and that it was very disturbing. Police say they have identified the woman seen in this video, but she has yet to come forward and reportedly lives out of state. But according to CNN, in an unreleased phone interview, she's disputing the claims against her, alleging that she was the one assaulted, seen on the ground at one point in the video, and that things escalated after she first asked to see hotel surveillance footage. She says she asked someone else in the lobby to empty their pockets before confronting Keon Harold Jr. Her phone was brought to her in an Uber. There's nothing to say to her, but look at the video. You have seen it, we have seen it, and it's just disappointing. And it's unfortunate and, and, and I mean, it's traumatic. It just does not need to happen. Harold's mother calling it a case of racial profiling. Isn't it the other way around? Innocent mm. until proven guilty. We are all supposed to have equal rights, for, the, but the reality is that we don't. Mm. So yes, this is a racial injustice issue. The idea of trauma goes above any charge that could ever be had. I want my son to grow up whole. That's right. That's, That's all right. we want. And from that CNN interview, the woman reportedly says that she's willing to investigate and co uh, rather cooperate with the investigation, but she has not reached out to the NYPD and she says the NYPD has not reached out to her. She also says that she's willing to talk to the Herald family with. We'll stand by and see if that happens. Adrian Bankert for us. Thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.